Nation's Mobile Delegates, I'm Ashley Esqueda, and it's time for your Mobile Nation's Monday Brief, where I bring you the best of Crackberry, the iPhone blog, Android Central, Windows Phone Central, and Pre-Central. It's been a not-so-busy week in tech, but we'll get into it anyway. Okay, Crackberry Nation, I will admit it, sometimes I'm really hard on RIM and BlackBerry in general, but this next story serves as a reminder that even though it might not be doing too hot here in the States, that BlackBerry is still pretty freaking popular in other places of the world. So the Pacific Place Mall in Jakarta, Indonesia was having a 50% off sale for the first 1,000 customers who bought a BlackBerry Bold 9790 pretty hotly anticipated item. Lots of people showed up to get the deal and it devolved into this. Secara paksa acara peluncuran sekaligus obral itu. Honestly, I am appalled by this kind of behavior. Americans would never do something like that for a bargain. That wasn't even for a phone. It was for a waffle maker. It seems like every week there's a brand new rumor surrounding the fate of WebOS, and this week is no different. There's a new rumor, so what is it? Well, it's insane. So if Hewlett Packard was to license out WebOS, which is an option at this point and is on the table, there is apparently a sticking point. The rumor is HP wants to keep WebOS for printers. Yes, because there is still a human being on this earth who touches their printer and feels it needs a touchscreen mobile OS to be better. And apparently that person is an executive at HP. The Android Central community this week has been going back and forth about a little issue that's affecting the Galaxy Nexus. So there's a pretty ugly voice volume bug that's happening. And Samsung has already said that they acknowledge the issue and that there is a fix going out for it. However, some people are saying it's a hardware problem and others are saying it's a software issue. So which one is it? Well, one of the community members at Android Central, the calm and talented systems engineer Lee Johnston says, it's actually both and has a little something to do with a term called debounce time. It's debounce time, yay, woo! In all seriousness, it's actually a hardware issue dealing with interference that's easily solved by a software fix. So everyone's right. This week over on Tip B, Renee and the gang talked about their holiday gift guides for 2011. They talked about the 10 best apps for a new iPhone user. And they also discussed how not funny the new Samsung commercial is that makes fun of iPhone users. Here's a clip if you haven't seen it. That's a Samsung. Yeah. Is this what adultery feels like? Samsung. Samsung. Pretty big display. It's the next thing, man. What else? I could never get a Samsung. I'm creative. Dude, you're a barista. Oh yeah, it's totally not funny. Because it's totally not true. <laughs> I guess some phones can dish it out, but can't take it. Please don't punch me, Georgia. Windows Phone Central was celebrating this week as Know Your Mobile 2011 announced their operating system of the year, and it was Windows Phone 7. They cited integration with Office, Bing, Zoom, and Xbox Live as reasons why they chose it, as well as the beautiful Metro UI. Here are some of the choicier quotes from the judges. It has the most potential with a unique interface and rapidly growing app selection. It has a great looking UI and doesn't look like Android or iOS. The runners up in this year's Know Your Mobile Awards for best operating system were, as expected, Blackberry and Bada. This is just like that time Jethro Tull beat Metallica for album of the year at the Grammys. Everyone rejoice! Georgia's schedule finally cleared up and we are going to have a Girls Gone Gadgets podcast this week. Looks like it's gonna be Thursday, but keep your eyes peeled on your favorite Mobile Nation site for more details. That's it for your Mobile Nations Monday Brief. Be sure to check out all of our podcasts at mobilenations.com slash shows. Be sure to also subscribe to our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash mobilenations. And you can follow me on Twitter at Ashley Eskeva. Nations, you have been briefed.